perform dramas and do worship, and then we use these, which are advantage cubes. I brought one to show you guys. It's really, really cool. It just like tells the story of Christ. And um, these things are amazing. We go off like as we norm. But um, so they get off the bus, and there's this little girl in this pink sweater. She didn't speak English, and I couldn't find a translator for the life of me. I'm just like, somebody help me. But it didn't work out. Um, but, so while they were performing a drama, I was just holding her and just like playing with her, and she never moved an inch from my body. She was just right there, unless her little brother ran off, and then she'd go get him and bring him right back. That was awesome. But just the look on her face, like when she looked at me, it was just like in her eyes, you could see like God was there. Like God used her to like use me in ways I can't even describe and imagine. It's just ridiculous. But so amazing because when when you find someone like that, like it could be just like here on campus. You just like look around. And there's that one person who's gonna like impact your life and make you feel like you're loved. And I just I want you guys to feel that because it's amazing. Like Josh, you have impacted my life because we're best friends basically. And I just hope you guys realize that who you have around you. Just, you're so lucky and like what you have now. And just, I can't describe how amazing and just awesome everything is. And so another girl who affected my life, I didn't feel like I was doing much while I was there. I'm just like, I'm not impacting anybody. I'm not making a difference. I'm just here. And um, so I went to the school called Joska. And when you get off the bus, it's, you go directly into like this huge dance party of just singing and dancing and running around. It was great. Um, but this girl named Jennifer and she just took my hand and I was just like, oh cool, so what do you like to do? What do you what do you love? And she's just like, I like to play soccer. And I'm just like, yes, I can relate. So I used to play soccer. And um, she's like, I like to sing. I'm like, sweet, I'm in choir. Awesome. And we ended up getting separated because we took a tour of the whole campus and like we had played soccer and I was like, okay, I'll find you later. We never found each other until like five minutes before we had to leave. And she comes up to me and she's just holding me and just like I'm holding her. And I get really emotional. I cry a lot. Like, if anybody has seen 27 dresses, I cry on that. I don't know how. I cry on that. And so she comes up and she's crying. And like, I was just like bawling like my eyes out. I was just like, oh my gosh, God. And just, I had an impact with somebody. And like, when I left, I cried the whole way home, which is like five hours. No, 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 three hours. Three hours back to the hotel. And uh, <laughs> it was like, yeah. it's, you go from a hotel to like, yeah. But, oh, Jeff, you went too. You were yeah. there. Yeah. But you were still there. It's cool. Um, and so I just sat on the bus, and my friends were around me, and I was just crying. And, like, when I got back to my room, I ended up getting sick for a whole chunk of the trip. It was bad. But, like, I realized, like, because of those two girls, I was able to, like, find out who I am what I am meant to do. I am meant to serve and I am meant to love people. And that is like what I enjoy most out of life. Like if I could do that forever, I totally would. And I just want you guys to like know that you guys are so loved. Like I can't express that enough. Like I just, oh. Oh, I, if you guys want to, okay, if you guys want to like pass it around. Casey Fleckenstein, please report to the activities office. Casey Fleckenstein to the activities office. Thank you. Beast room. God totally like strengthened me. Uh, we performed dramas, and I was in one of the dramas. And another, like my best friend now, uh, Sarah Scotty, she goes to tour, whatever. Um, her and I were like so sick. Yeah, we were basically like dead. It was horrible. Like we almost got sent home. But um, we were figuring out like, okay, we barely have strength. Stand. So we're just like, God, just give us strength. And like, I'm still amazed 
promise to like dance around and move around and use my awesome boa <laughs> of awesomeness. Yeah. I played a flirt and it's really weird. But um, just God used his strength and just like fed it through all of us. And like if you look back on it now, I just I'm so amazed. And like to the like I was sick to the point where it was ridiculous. And I got up every single day because of God. And I was just like, okay, God, how are you going to use me? How are you going to strengthen me? Like, I need you. And sometimes I forget that. Like, I don't understand, like, why I forget it. 